He said it was a mutual aid call in Moorhead, and he showed up. And he, yeah, everybody, you know, all the all the police departments were responding. He gets out and grabs a shotgun, and boom. <laughs> Did it take a while to get everybody calmed down? I mean, you were well, too long. They figured it out. Yeah. I mean, you were good. You were good. Ed was a good person. But he liked his boots. Oh, yeah. I do not know. You know the big white truck in Moorhead at West End Station, that big white truck there? And when you see it, you, you know what you, I mean, let me think here. Once you see it, you remember it. It's that big white truck in Moorhead at West End Station. They're stationed on this end of uh, town. It's a real horse, yeah. We, we went to Philadelphia and picked that up. Wow. Because it was uh, actually featured at the International Firemen's Convention, or Fire Chief's Convention. And look, when we come out of Philadelphia, we look from the region, and that's from I told the king, you know, the king, you know, the fire chief, go ahead. I don't know what you mean. I told him, I said, chief, there's a ten wheeler dump truck that was dirty. Make sure I think we can make it. And where people don't realize it, it's a lot of time work. Go on out there. Or you put up a curve time when it starts to the Because if you have a wreck on it, then they're But he was a household name around our house. We, we enjoyed Chief Crawford. I, I can't tell you the number of times where I would hear a, uh, Ed Crawford call from Pine Old Shores uh, tell Daddy Ed Crawford call. Or Ed call. Man, I would have to do that. He was the fire chief for a while, too. He was like the public safety guru. <laughs> Thank you.